In this short video, I'm going to be showing you how to use ChatGPT in Swedish. Now, whether you want to translate just the front page of ChatGPT to the Swedish language, or whether you want to actually speak with ChatGPT in Swedish and get a reply back in the Swedish language, that's totally possible. And in the next two minutes, I'm going to show you everything you need to do in order to get it working. Now, with that said, I do want to mention one thing. There is actually no official way to change the language to ChatGPT because it is only available in English. If you take a look on the left-hand side here, there is no uh, settings button. Um, to change anything really, but there is a way around that. Now I am using Google Chrome on a Windows PC, so if you're using a different browser, operating system or device, then the process might be a bit different for you. Um, but just to give yourself the best chance for this to work, no matter what device or operating system you're using, make sure that you are at least using Google Chrome, because I'm not sure whether any of the other browsers have this feature um, in them. So, once you are on the page uh, with ChatGPT, simply right click on the screen and then click on Translate to. As you can see, Manu already says Swedish here. So the second I press this button, it's going to translate the entire page. There you go. Now, to add Swedish uh, to your list of languages, click on the three dots here. Then click on choose another language. And then click on the arrow and find Swedish in this massive list of languages. Now it is right down here. Click on it. Then click on done. Uh, in your case, it might say translate. Click on that and it will automatically translate the page to Swedish. Now, when it comes to actually getting your output in the Swedish language, you don't need to do anything. Simply talk to ChatGPT in Swedish and it will automatically detect your language and give uh, give you an answer in Swedish. So, to test this out, I've actually copied and pasted the phrase from Google that says, how are you in Swedish? And let's see what it comes back with. Now, it is giving me an error. If that happens to you, simply refresh the page and try again and it will work just like normal. And in just a few seconds, oh, there we go. Uh, took literally one second for ChatGPT to come back to me with a response in the Swedish language. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please do go ahead and leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions, uh, let me know and I'll be more than happy to help.